Hey everybody, Revert to Means. Jared, I'm back for you. Got a good one for you. Just came from Huntington Beach to Westlake Village, California. I am on the corner of Thousand Oaks Boulevard and Westlake Boulevard. Had a couple viewer tips. Say, hey, go up there. So here I am. Look at this, folks. I'm in a big shopping center. I just shot a... Sh I'm going to post a short later. There's a huge building on the corner. Rodeo Realty. For lease signs. For lease signs. Everywhere. Look behind me, too. I just pulled into this very nice shopping center uh, next to the Fidelity Investments. Uh, we got... Hmm. Common Sight. Lockbox. Uh, anyways, I wanted to start this video off. And before I do, please take a few seconds. Uh, hit that subscribe button down below. And hit the thumbs up button. I'd appreciate it. I'm new to this. Just trying to grow the channel. Um, open up some eyes. Um, so, I wanted to start this off, folks. Just had about an hour and a half drive. I wanted to say um, something I heard a long time ago, and it just popped into my head. Don't, first of all, if you have a roof over your head, if you have your health, first of all, if you have your health, and you, you have a roof over your head, and you have a job, and you have food, maybe you're blessed, you have a vehicle, you're blessed. Count your blessings, folks. Literally especially going forward um, count your blessings be grateful many people don't have that uh, so I just want to start off with that and then don't fall into the trap you know my drive through LA sitting in traffic coming up here don't fall into the trap of FOMO buying new cars um, buying this buying that this and that to keep up with your pals don't do it it's a trap don't buy a new house to impress your friends don't buy a new car to impress your friends You'll learn. I, I learned a long time ago, so stay tuned. I'm going to walk around the center and see what else we got. Stay tuned. Thanks. Kind of nice and cool in this spot. Nice fountain. But uh, I'm checking out here. I uh, just walked by a Sharkies, and they got yeah, a few people out. It is it's pretty warm, but pleasant in the shade. Um, I did notice, look over behind me. Uh, there's a big restaurant that's out of business. Uh, and... In general, the parking lot's fairly empty. Summertime, midsummer, it's not that terribly hot either. Um, just kind of pan around. Fairly empty. I'm gonna walk down the rest of there. Stay tuned. Even the Bevmo I just walked by I had nobody in there. And oh, this one says it's leased, apparently. Look at that. Leased says lockbox. Um, comment below what are you guys seeing in your area we still got stickers on the ground big building it says it's leased it is thrashed inside too um, I mean look at it. we're in a very nice upper class area and there's just trash here there's shopping carts um, hmm. no hiring work at the corner bakery cafe that's open that nobody's in very high-end mall folks comment below what do you think <clears throat> what are you guys seeing I got a, a good one here for you pardon the crows um, heard a radio station um, out of LA I listened to 790 um, the guy <laughs> There was a talk show that was just starting, and they called it the top. The name of the show was Taxifornia. I haven't heard that in a long time. It's true, Taxifornia, highest uh, taxes in the country. Dynamite. Hey, we got a Bed Bath and Beyond that's open, but um, not many shoppers into the Bed Bath. And beyond. And, and look at that huge bakery. I was just that huge corner section. There's there's nobody. I didn't see anyone in there. Um, crazy. Crazy. Crazy things. Okay, here's another one I got on radio uh, just about a half hour ago. Gentleman who used to work for the uh, Small Business Institute in California. A private, private institution. Um, he doesn't work there any longer, but he was just making fun of, and I know this firsthand, I'm sure my subscribers do, if you're new to the channel, 
Here in California, we have about a kajillion different departments of, um, you got Cal OSHA, you got CARB, California Air Resource Board. There's so many different departments that are a detriment to small business. Um, it's so hard to start a small business and stay in business. Yet, the economic driver of our country is small business. It's small, many people are mistaken. Economic driver of our country, pardon that glare, is small business, small to medium business. It's not these huge corporations that drive our economy, that, that employ people. It's the um, small to medium business. So he was getting at um, small business in California in the last three months, and he was dead honest. He said, it's not what mainstream media is portraying, folks. Small businesses in California in the last three months Startups are down over 50%, and he was blunt. He said, it's bad, bad, bad. He said it three times. Um, so be aware of that. That's something, you know, that's not on MSNBC, CNBC, CNN, whatever. Fox News, I don't care what you listen to, what side of the aisle you're on, but um, that's a fact. And I, I get it. I'm a small business owner, and... Certain types, of, majority types of businesses in our state, so hard to start, so hard to maintain and make a profit and have positive cash flow, it's tough. So I, I get where that statement uh, is coming from. Comment below, what do you guys think about that statement? True? What about other parts of the country? Um, let us know, let's get some good conversation going. Look behind me, folks. There's no one around. Uh, I just walked by an urgent care facility and there's a bunch of people walking in with masks. So they're gonna go get tested here. I'm, I'm, a, I, I'm not a gambling man. It says it's leased. That's window dressing. Why is there still a lockbox on it? I guarantee you if I shoot here again in two months, it's gonna be empty. No one's taking on a lease of this size. Um, I got five bucks on it. Anybody else? <laughs> and I'll come back here too not that far from where I live but um, so I guess people are still getting tested for the <coughs> whatever to each his own right I found out my grandmother used to say that but it was an old song back in the 30s um, to each his own if, if you're getting tested at this stage for the cough wouldn't you know you have it even though I think it's very minimal I don't know once again I'm not a financial advisor uh, tax advisor, business advisor, economic advisor, moral advisor, and I'm not a doctor, so take it for what you will, but I'm still kind of blown away. It's Sunday afternoon. Westlake Village, California, ladies and gentlemen. It's hitting the wealthy, but the wealthy know what's going on. If you saw my video this morning from Huntington Harbor, they know what's going on sad sad to see this but not gonna get better all right folks I'm gonna wrap this up I'm just walking out of the shopping center uh, I'm gonna show you this big restaurant right on the stinking corner of Thousand Oaks Boulevard and Westlake Boulevard I'm just gonna walk out here a little bit I'm in Northgate Plaza right this is a great area I love this area Clean, nice, I'm not gonna get mugged like I almost did in a video a few weeks ago. Check that out in Oxnard. It's a very safe community. This is what I'm gonna post a short on. I was sitting in my truck. So back, I'll try and zoom in here. Bear with me. So right on that corner, that's Thousand Oaks Boulevard, Westlake Boulevard. Big office, commercial uh, office. Rodeo Realty for lease signs right on the corner. There's another one there. Um, and across me, you can see gas is right at five bucks here, but bear with me. This huge restaurant on the corner, it's called Maya, Mayan or Maya, Mexican cuisine. It's closed, folks. I just saw a lockbox on there. Stick with me. Had to unzoom there. Sorry about that, but we got windows boarded up. Very nice restaurant. Look, look, look at it. Awesome. Kind of really neat restaurant I've never eaten here I don't know how long it was here pretty sad to see though that this bit the dust huge wraparound 
Look, they even had an outdoor patio. That, that's not going to cut it, though. Um, they still got their menu up. Uh, gosh. Yeah, Maya Mexican cuisine lockbox on the door. Bummer. Looked like it was a nice place. If anybody's eating here who's from the area, Thousand Oaks, T.O., Westlake Village, Agora, Calabasas, shoot a comment below. Was it good? Was it, or was it, uh, was it poor business management? Or was it the economy? I got five bucks. It was the, uh, <coughs> the cough in the economy. I'm going to wrap it up there, head back to my truck, uh, get back on the highway. Comment below. Subscribe, like, dislike if you dislike. Um, and check out the website. If you get a minute, reverttomeans.com in the description. I got some links down there for uh, some Amazon stuff. I don't care where you get it. Gold, silver, you're going to want that going forward. going to hold its value. It's going to be... I have a, a, an inkling, folks. I'm not a fortune teller. Uh, we're going to see gold make a big jump here. I don't know if it's going to be this week, uh, next month. From what I've read, uh, I think in the next whew, two, I don't know, two to six months, you're going to see gold and silver make a big pop upwards. Uh, so, yeah, I'll leave it with that. Leave it, uh, sorry, leave it at that. And, um, Go to the website, there's links uh, for emergency uh, food storage, water storage, water purification, um, some finance books, things like that. Check it out. Um, I don't care where you get this stuff, but it never hurts to have it. Worst thing you have is extra water and extra food. So uh, that's it. I appreciate it. And thank you guys for watching and sharing, trying to open some eyes, get some people's heads out of town. You know what I have noticed in the shopping center? Look behind me. You don't see this in Westlake Village, folks. And by, back by that fountain, there's trash laying around. There's trash laying around, the parking lot, abandoned these shopping carts. Look behind me, there's shopping carts strewn everywhere. Very, very odd times in Westlake Village, California. Crazy. Uh -huh. I haven't been, I haven't stopped in Westlake. I drive through here all the time, but um, pretty gnarly. Enjoy that view too. This is a beautiful area up the hills and uh, yeah. Hope everybody's well. Enjoy the rest of the weekend. This will probably post Sunday evening this evening, but um, have a good start to the week. Give somebody a smile, say hi to somebody. People are hurting, people are stressed. So thank you for watching, bye.